My name is Adeze Chikude from Anambra State. Um, my sickness started two months ago. There was a day I was going to work. So on my, I was at the bus stop. I jumped one woman. She was putting on white. So she called me. He saw a woman putting on white. And she called me. She said I should come. So I went to her. She now told me that, uh, my daughter, that you have an arrow in your body. That she make sure I go and treat it very well. Instead, my enemy would die. I said, no problem. So that very day, I went home. I went into my I was crying, crying, crying. So on the process of crying, my neighbor heard when I was crying. She now came to me. She said, Auntie Daisy, what happened now? I explained things to her. She now said, I should not bother myself. That let her go and put on her clothes. That she would take me to one woman's place. I said, okay. So when we get there, the woman was, she's from a, a Kerobi man. Sorry, continue the testimony. Don't mention the name of the church. Okay. So immediately I entered her house. She said, Jesus, uh -uh, that I have arrow in my body that, ah, God, who, that, who did I offend? I said, me. I said, in fact, that's why I came. She said, I should not worry that she will heal it. So she now asked me to buy some items. I bought them. Which item? Like can do lamp and uh, um, and uh, this um, uh, fluorescent this fluorescent light so i bought them fluorescent this fluorescent rechargeable lights so she now said she will do prayer for me for 21 days i said okay so she now gave me one medicine that she'll be using it for arrow and i said no she gave you medicine for arrow so i took the medicine the medicine worked that very day because I saw the sign. So, but after then, my sickness was, in fact, I, if you see me at work, always, always crying. So, one of the brothers that normally comes to this place saw me crying that day and came to me and said, Auntie Adeze, give me name, what is wrong with you? So, I explained to him, I said, but I don't know that it is as if I'm dying, you know, that you push to help me. He now said that I should not bother myself, that tomorrow, when he's coming, that he will bring bottle water. So, when he brought that water, bottle water, after drinking the bottle water, I went home. So I went to go and ease myself. After easing myself, uh, to wash myself, and I saw long rope. So from my, I just, I was drawing that rope. rope. from where? From my private part. So I was drawing that rope. So after drawing that rope, I was, I, I now had the rope. I was looking at the rope. They tied the rope three places. So I was like, uh, uh, what? You saw the road from private part? Yes, sir. And you are drawing it from the private part? Yes, I was drawing it. So after that, uh, uh, I was scared. I now threw it inside, those, inside the, um, WC. So I was scared. The following day I went to work. I said, ah, see no bro, see oh, that water you gave me, see what happened. After drinking seraphic water. Yes, sir. He gave me three and said I should be drinking it and be praying for it. So I was surprised after that day. He now said I should know what I should just be drinking it. That day, where is the rope? I said I've flushed the rope. He said, No. That why, why did I flush the rope? That I would have snapped the rope so that I would bring it to church. I said, which so the next day, I drank the water. You can't believe it. I vomited key. So that key I vomited ever since then. But the only problem I have now is I'm always, as in, always, what am I Where doing? is the key? That's what I told you. I said I saw Oh, yeah, watch your television. A little bit key, what is it? Oh, then I go see you. This two television is not working. It's a Jesus, so my name is a Jesus, so my Jesus, so my name is a 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 Ebu bedu zayoni maram ne jere. Ebu bedu zayoni maram ne jere. Icho beba na gwo ya ye. Icho beba na gwo ya ye. Fere Jesus I got you ya hanga. Fere do 
you, Jesus. I can throw ya. Hey, Bube. Hey, Bube, I got a chance in my arms. Hey, Bube, I got a chance in my arms. Hey, Bube, I got a chance in my arms. Hey, Bube, I got a chance in my arms. Hey, Bube, I got a chance in my arms. Each of a man of warrior, Jesus, he go. All the way, all the way, Jesus, Amen. sister, open your mouth. Your healing is permanent, and any remaining thing in this body is vanished today. In Jesus' name. Amen. How many times have you come to Zion? This is my first time. Today is her first time because of this miracle. After drinking seraphic water, she has to come to Zion. Amen. Amen. You are set free today. In Jesus' holy name. Amen. Turn to Jesus. Amen. You know, when they are giving this testimony, that like somebody says she's drawing robe from her private part. The robe tied in three places. It's real, though. It has happened to my presence. So when I was seeing people in a Iruag hall, really, there was a day people came to see me then. I could not see everybody. When I was going, one woman was crying, I mean, eh, she was crying terribly that she came from first time. She didn't see me. If you see her womb, swallow up. And the Holy Ghost said to me, touch her womb, give her only oil to drink. I hit my hand on her stomach three times. And I gave her only boy. And she drank. And when she went home, she went to poop. One big part of started coming out from me. And she shouted. The husband came and saw serpent and ran away. It happened to be the Holy Ghost have arrested the python. So even the python could not bite her. The woman was there, naked in the toilet, shouting, My husband, do, dear, but I'm pop palaga. <laughs> All these years, she has been having moving objects without you knowing that Python has been moving. And eventually, the husband gathered courage and collected cutlass, came into the toilet and killed the Python. Another one put her. They killed the two python, brought the python to me. The next month, the woman took it. It happens to be that the mama of the husband loved her so much. The woman was taking her from one native daughter to another that she must have a child. Because it was their years of marriage, no issue. They were giving her Moroguna Papuko. Projected serpent in her womb. Think the woman thought it was a baby. So when she's giving testimony, I understand something. Spiritual thing is more than human comprehension. Ihi gama atoroni. You must be very careful. Oh, so we thank God for healing her. God will heal you. Don't you? I can't see. God will heal you. <laughs>